Hi and welcome back to my channel. Um, I realise it's been a very, very long time since I last uploaded a Slimming World video. Um, I was just having a look back in my book and it's actually, I've had seven weigh-ins since then so it has been a long time but I've still been plodding on with it and I've still been doing really well. I've actually still had consistent weight losses um, some have been bigger than others but every single week has definitely been a weight loss which is just amazing um, yeah I'm still really enjoying the diet I don't really see it as a diet anymore um, it's just about making good choices um, I still have naughty days um, you wouldn't be human if you didn't but I do find that if I have a naughty day or night um, in a week, oh that sounded a bit, <laughs> a bit bad, I mean, <laughs> obviously this is food, um, food talk, nothing else, but yeah, if um, I do have a naughtier food night or day, then I find that if I balance that out um, by having very good days during the week that I still will see a loss. Um, so yeah, I don't, it's not really diet anymore, I just see it as it's the way my, um, my diet habit has changed. Um, and yeah, I'm still losing the weight. Um, the week just gone, I actually lost, um, a pound and a half, which for me is actually, um, not bad weight loss, because no weight loss is a bad weight loss, but... Um, I've been very used to each week losing about three to four pounds so when I lose a little bit less like a pound and a half I think I've lost half a pound another week Um I don't get disheartened it's definitely not disheartened but um, I do think oh, I really wish that I'd have tried that little bit harder and lost those few more pounds which is just silly really because it is still a loss and it's still getting me closer to my target which I still haven't set um, I'm, I think, four and a half pounds off my next, um, intermittent target, um, but I still haven't set an end goal. I'm not really sure where I'm going with this. Um, once I hit my next intermittent target, I am going to set another one for another stone, um, and just see where that gets me, really. Um, I, more than anything, just want to feel comfortable with the way I look. I want to feel comfortable in my clothes. Um... I'm not really interested in the numbers on the scale. Um, I know some people are, some people want to hit a certain weight, but that that isn't me. Um, I don't really mind what I weigh as long as I feel comfortable in how I am. Not quite there yet, so um, I am gonna go down another stone and then reevaluate once I get closer to that target and decide where I want to go from there. Um, Personally, I can see that I will probably carry on and at least lose another half a stone after that, but I'm unsure. Like I said, I won't know until I'm there, really. Um, so, yeah, we'll just have to see how that goes. Um, so, yeah, in total now, I have, I've hit my two stone seven pounds, um, and I think I've actually... Oh, I can't think how much I've lost all together. Isn't that bad? <laughs> um, I have lost seven, eight, nine, nine. Uh, I think it's two stone nine and a half pounds I've lost now. So um, I'm getting close to the free free stone, which would be really good if I hit it this week. But um, I can't see it. I feel like I'm really bloating at the minute. I don't know why. Uh, TMI. Um, it possibly could be ladies' problems. Um, I've started on the uh, mini pill and I have found that sometimes I just randomly bloat with it and don't know why but anyway never mind if I hit the free stone amazing if I don't I will get it next week that's that is exactly how it is if it's not this week it will definitely be next week and um, because I will push and hit it the following week for sure Another great thing that happened in the month of July is I got this award, which is Slimmer of the Month. I was absolutely ecstatic. Through the month of July, I actually in total lost £13, which is absolutely amazing. So I was a pound off of losing a full stone in July, which, wow. <laughs> um, it, it really is crazy um 
when they gave it to me I wasn't expecting it at all because um I had like I said two um lesser losses I lost a pound and a half and then a few weeks back I only lost half a pound so I really didn't didn't think I'd done that well through the month of July it just proves that it is an individual um individual weight losses when you start adding them all together through a period of time you it is a big amount of weight that you're losing so um yeah I was absolutely ecstatic um it just made me think back to the beginning of my journey um and how far I actually have come um to nearly be at freestone is incredible I've done slimming well before but I've never really had the motivation to lose the weight um, and I used to always get stuck at around just before the stone and a half mark and I was really worried that that was, was going to happen again this time um, which wouldn't have been great for me because I was at a point after having Eli um, that I just really wasn't happy with the way I looked. The whole way through the pregnancy I really struggled with the weight gain um, and I was determined that at the end of the pregnancy I was going to go full throttle at a diet and I was going to get to where I wanted to be and that is exactly what I have done and I am so so proud of myself, I am so so pleased with the results. Um, yeah I still have a little way to go but um, when I put clothes on now I don't feel like ugh look I'm actually starting to feel good. Um, amazingly I bought some jeans um, that I now fit into um, I bought them from H&M I ordered a size 16 knowing that they come up a bit smaller from H&M and they actually sent me a size 14 which I was absolutely gutted about they were in the sale um, I wasn't going to be able to get another pair um, and I was just absolutely gutted that I wasn't going to get into these jeans and I think it happened it was about three or so weeks ago I tried them on again and they, they fit absolutely perfectly so um, I am absolutely thrilled with the way it's going I'm starting to look at my body now and like what I see more and um, there is definitely still room for improvement don't get me wrong but um, if for some reason the weight didn't start coming off and I was stuck here it wouldn't be the end of the world I am quite happy with the way I look um, my partners even said it's great to see me happy and smiling again about um, clothes I'm putting on and it really is just amazing I'm so so pleased with like I said with how far I've come um, I think you can possibly tell I think I've said that about 20 times now <laughs> but yeah um, and I'm really excited to see where this is going to go and hopefully it won't be too much longer and I will get to my end goal wherever that will be so fingers crossed that won't be too long away um, okay well thank you for watching guys and please 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 it would be amazing if you could subscribe and I will see you next time bye